All right, guys, I'm about to drop a campaign that is going to revolutionize your mindset and level up your lifestyle. Are you ready? Okay, it is hashtag no memes. That's right. Just stop posting memes. Stop doing it. Let it go. It's juvenile. It's masturbatory. And I don't mean the, the, the pretty, you know, pictures with the inspirational quote kind of memes. I mean the shitty little drawings with the little crying eyes and the, the idealized version of you over here and the idealized version of your enemy over here and all the reasons why they suck and all the reasons why you're so much better because I don't believe it. I don't believe you're that guy. I think you're just jerking yourself off. You know what that guy's doing, that perfect guy, that Chad dude or whoever you want to be? You know what this guy is doing? He's not sitting around posting memes all day. He's out running a business. He's taking martial arts. He's working out. He's learning a new skill. He's reading a book. He's fucking his wife. He's making babies. He's buying a house. He's selling a house. He's having an adventure somewhere. He's moving across the country. He's doing something. He's not just sitting around posting memes to his little group of friends with their anonymous handles and little secret telegram groups giggling about things that they're so angry about but have no control over whatsoever. Like I said, it, it, it's masturbatory. And you know, I got the idea for this hashtag campaign uh, from the other famous hashtag campaign, hashtag no fat. Another campaign about masturbation. Uh, and, and, you know, the thing about that is I don't know why you'd want to announce to the world that, hey guys, I didn't touch myself today. Because it kind of implies that every day prior, you could not stop furiously masturbating. So, I don't know why you'd want to share that with the world. I don't think it's a good look. I don't, I, you know, I don't think it's very dignified. Well, that's really none of my business. That's up to you. You know, I get it. Memes are funny. You know, I laugh at them. They, you know, it's, it's a, it, it, they're good jokes sometimes. But, you know, I was around for the last great meme war. Uh, you know, and, uh, you know, guess what? The world's worse. Whatever you're doing, it didn't change a goddamn thing. Did you really rise up? Did you really save the West? Did you really save your country? Did you really change anything? No, no you didn't. So maybe it's time to take a new strategy. Let this crappy meme culture go. You know, if you grew up with that, hey, I get it, man. You grew up with it. But maybe it's time to leave childish things behind and take life a little bit more seriously. And while we're talking about all these masturbatory things, and these addictions that people have, let's talk about anger porn. Because I think that's the real pornography today, especially right now. All of you guys, and it's the same guys a lot of the times, so you're, you're posting every day, you know, this new outrageous thing, this new thing that made you so mad. Can you believe that they're doing this? Can you believe that they said this? Yeah, man, I can believe it because I've been watching communists for the past 20 years. All the crappy people who hate America have been doing the exact same thing for a really long time. Uh, so whatever they do, it actually doesn't surprise me at all. I mean, sometimes they, they even, you know, they really jump the shark and impress me, but uh, generally speaking, you know, I, I can't get mad about that every day, and you shouldn't either. Uh, because getting mad about it doesn't change anything. You know, posting it in a group to all your friends who believe the exact same things, uh, you're not changing anyone's opinion. You're not converting anyone. Uh, so what's the point of it? Aside from commiserating, right? You're, you're sharing your pain. You know, how, how is that helpful? So stop it. Let's say 30 days, make it a campaign. 
hashtag no memes, hashtag no anger porn. Because I think that's what you're actually addicted to. And the question is, can you quit?